Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. My name's Eskif Gaming, back with placement game number three. The placement games aren't going particularly well, as you can see at the top of your screen. We're currently zero and two. Um, both games, although we've done, um, I would say, mostly positive in our lane, um, our, t our teammates aren't doing quite so well. So hopefully maybe we can try and carry around some positives. So we're playing our third game and we're playing our third different champion. And... Possibly a champion that I won't be playing quite as much, but I felt like it was actually a good opportunity to play him considering what we required. So I'm playing Orn, and we're up against a one-trick Garen. Um, so, and he doesn't seem good on the champion either. Um, Professor, obviously you can't see it because I haven't updated, haven't done the overlay for it yet. I am going to try and do that at some point off stream, maybe tonight, if not tomorrow. Um, but um, a one-trick Garen that doesn't look very good on him. So, um, to think that it's a one-trick Garen that that's not even good on their one-trick, you know, might be a positive thing, but then I have picked Orn. If I had managed to pick Mordekaiser, which is not that bad against a Garen, if you play it right, um, then, um, obviously we can do, um, some quite good things in that matchup, but, but as you can see, we're up against a Garen, so... One thing I am going to be trying out, though, is the brand new Jack Show. So Jack Show got a change, which is a nerf to bruisers and fighters that were using it. So, like, sort of, say, Yasuo or Yone or um, even Mordekaiser, um, it's been nerfed all. But for actual tanks, like, say, an Orn, it has been buffed. Because you're supposed to be getting better bonuses if you're taking more resistances. AI, say for example, you know, you're getting a Sunfire and then you're getting a Jack Show, then a Frozen Hot, maybe, you know, even getting um, like a Force of Nature. So the lanes look pretty interesting overall. Um, we've just seen the cane somewhere. I do not know where. Oh, that's why he's placed a ward there. Okay, fair enough. Um, but yeah, so the mid lane is possibly, um, for me personally, the most interesting matchup out of the lot. Syndra versus Cassiopeia. So Syndra got a mid-scope update um, in the closing end of last season. And has proved to be one of the most popular champions since then. It is childish to favor one tool over another. Um, and Cassiopeia has not picked a great amount unless you're very skilled at the champion. Cassiopeia can be quite scary. She can, so... Of course, Archangel Seraph's also got a uh, very good buff as well. Um, so, Actually doing quite a good amount of damage to him. First blood. Double kill. 
Well, it's just given going double buffs after all the hard work that I've just done in top lane. And uh, and Talon just willingly gifts a Garen double buffs. That is really bad. Okay. Um, I think I might even rush a Bramble tonight. There is that um, shout that I do. I am trading with him quite a lot, but he's not necessarily doing quite as much damage to me, however. There's a shot that might even go fumble and stuff, possibly. Yeah, all of a sudden he's just gotten all that confidence. What is this Garen doing? He has way too much confidence for his own good. It's like, yeah, yeah, all you all, all you are is an Orn. I can still do damage. Even at early game. Like, come on, like, Orn is supposed to be weak at this stage. Wow, I am so surprised that I've just managed to get a kill, and now I'm the one with double buffs. And he's probably going to be annoyed with himself for that. Like, it did, it did help me quite a lot, by the way, that he did get a tower shot on him. But still... Yeah, I should never be killing him at this stage in the game. I should not. Humans have done something right. I don't need to just put a point in secure. Didn't mean to do that. survive just about and I got a lot of gold as well from that I'm playing this game a lot a lot better than my previous two like I don't think I did that badly in the first two like particularly the Mordecai of the game, which was in the first one. But this one, I'm doing a lot better. Which, tanks do suit my playstyle a bit better. I'm a little bit more used to actually being An the initiator. Oh, that's unfortunate. 
I would say Cassiopeia does kind of have the better matchup at this stage in the game. But Syndra can do quite a lot. She has taken Electrocute, which is a bit of a field bad man, I feel. Miss that cannon. If I wasn't silenced, that would have been a good E, because that I wouldn't have needed my Q. It just keeps on running in between the lane, which he's not being respectful. Has been slain. I can see why he's got a bad with Garen um, on his profile and Professor, because he just doesn't respect. I could did help out quite a lot that I was able to actually poke him down with uh, my grasp. But yeah, like uh, Garen should not be losing to an one. Once a human kneels, they rarely stand again. Wow, I missed that. Let's see, I need twelve hundred. An ally has been slain. Oh, that's the Talon who's one and three. Wonder if he has TP up again. I'm gonna try and go for two tower plates if I can. Okay, Naz just recently. Oh, he's already here. The last little bit of mana. Maybe it's a little bit greedy for me staying here with all the gold that I have. Turret plating will fall soon. But yeah, Syndra's Syndra's not quite as strong.
They shouldn't be going without me, though. I will say that. All I need is myself. And, and they're kind of forcing it, they are right now. I love a okay, they... Hey, I got it! I got the Herald, sucker! <laughs> oh, dear. That was a good TP. Like, obviously, I'm not getting anything for it, apart from the Herald itself. But... Obviously, I can't lay a ward down. That's the only issue that I do have. I might end up starting to be camped at this point now. Okay, not bad. I don't get the, uh, I don't obviously get the assist, but I at least get XP. Ooh, Cassiopeia's here. Okay, let's get out of here. Yeah, the Cassiopeia's very strong at the moment, so... She has gone over Fosto, which is interesting. I guess she's worried about me. But then if she was worried about me, she would go be going Leandri's. I guess a little bit more. Yeah, I am going to go four miles second and frozen heart, probably. I will need to get a fo force of nature, though, for the Cassiopeia. You know, because she does do an alarmingly high amount of damage. Oh, she's dead again. The frilly old forger's men now whatever children are, do go back. Just ping that to the uh, Talon in case he wants to come up again. Yeah, we don't want to fight around with the Cassiopeia right now. An ally has been slain. She fo she focused on me and got killed by the Talon. Okay, that's good. That's good teamwork right there. And look at that, the Garen fleed. <laughs> That's not bad. Oh, Mr. Cannon. I do not need company. Keep out company. Right, so now I'm level thirteen. Some orny gameplay. Quiet you. <laughs> the thing is, I'm level 13. Cinder's level 12, but she's 0 and 4. Um, now, the question is, who do I um, give the uh, 
empowered mythic like because what Orn does what makes Orn very unique is that he gives special items uh, to champions and when mythics came out um instead of it being oh they just impact they're just special items that only Orn can give they change it to okay now it has to be the mythic I keep on missing um, towers with all <laughs> um, towers, um, cannons. Yeah, that's unfortunate. I didn't respect the fact that the center was there as well. So, you know, we both disrespected that, to be honest. You know, I don't know why the Talons is uh, pinging the Morgana. And I guess the Kaisa's has outscaled the uh, Misfortune, I guess. Well, actually, she's not doing too well. Um... Why is Morgana trying to take on the Senna and the Cassio? Okay. I didn't die. My forge missed me. Your turret has been destroyed. I don't want to be playing with my team just yet, because I'm very close to getting um well, actually, Dragon's about to come up, isn't it? Okay, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to... I guess I should actually give it to the Talon first because he's the most powerful out of the lot. All of us. Yeah, unfortunately, we're going to lose another dragon. Oh, hello, Garen. Yeah, let's not fight that right now because the rest of the team are all going to be there. the cinder is doing oh that's a bit of a
Nice. Okay. We've got some momentum back. Um, guess give it to the morgue. I never finished uh, actually giving it either. There we go. Okay, I've done enough. You do the rest, guys. <laughs> that ult was so impressive. My god. Right, I'm going Sunfire next. Do I? No. Oh, it's actually telling me to go Sunfire. Okay. Um, let's, let's actually do it right. It's really weird. Oh, is that why he's not doing any damage? That would make sense. He's not doing any damage because he's gone hot still. This is a very weird Garen player. Oh, and Talon's just died, for goodness sake. I couldn't get in line. That's my first death in now quite a while. That is. Yeah. The thing is, this this Garen is gonna win because our team just seems to be. I don't know. You know, this is the downside to playing a tank. Yeah, the next argument is going to be for Syndra. Well, we're level 15 right now, so I bet they hit level 16. That was a weird ignite. Still no water in the fountain. How on earth? How on earth does an Orn steal a Drake from a Cassiopeia? What? Right, okay. That should have been. Oh, and now they're literally just inting. This is becoming unbelievable. This is really. Like, this is just stupid. It's just legit, legit stupid. Like, it doesn't matter how well we play in top lane. You know, it's because, like, everybody's just in running it down. It is frustrating. It really is. 
you know, and I'm normally a very chill player. I don't tend to get annoyed very often, but, you know, it is one of those games because no matter what we do, you know, as much as what we do, the enemy, the rest of our allies just seem to be basically throwing it back away from me, no matter what I do. Okay, let's get us on fire now. Good thing we have actually got a good wave clear. But why are we messed up this far? Oh. Guess I'm gonna have to delay it even further. Your turret has been destroyed. Right. So every single champion now on my team now has the uh, the special um, items now. We need to play for this. The issue that we have is that. Pretty much everything on our team are all one-shottable, apart from me. Because I am just that tanky. Oh, I missed that. Okay, we managed to steal Dragon again. Yeah. Like, the rest of the team are just so far behind. And there's the, uh, the talent just blaming it on everybody else and not focusing it on himself. 
Like, I felt like I've played very well in this game, and there's just not really that much that I can do. And that's disappointing. No, it's, like, I didn't even get uh, Windows Approach, actually. I didn't even need it. Almost. There was a couple of occasions where, like, maybe I could have got it, actually. Cassie appears still Shut not down. bought, um... Archangels. I didn't die. My forge missed me. An ally has been slain. Your turret has been destroyed. He had to flash that one. Okay, we got it. And now we just push one lane and push it hard. That's the best thing we can do right now, is just try and push one lane and push it hard. Yeah, I can just feel obnoxiously tanky. Right, the dragon's about to come up. That means the talent should stop roaming. Right, I did tell him. Where on earth did that come from? Labor is life's I didn't even get my ult off, by the way. Your 
I'm going to repeatedly ping that to tell everybody, come on, we need to go and move on. Just got to be careful. Okay, Garen's in top lane trying to deal with the farm up there. But we've somehow managed to scale. Oh, I missed my ult, didn't I? Oh, whoops. Okay, let's get out of here now. Why are we going back in? Okay, yeah. Let's get out of this one. Oh, what is going on? I'll try giving Morgana as much time as I could. But oh my god. I lasted so long in that. And maybe I should have just grouped with the rest of my team. Maybe. Maybe that was the mistake. Oh, okay. I don't think it's the answer to actually go for it now. Yeah, and there you go. Look, they've just lost us this. Oh, my God. Like, no. There isn't many players actually thinking in this game. An ally has been slain.
Yeah, let's just get the dragon. Bloody hell. I have done so much in this game is unbelievable. Yeah. Like, I've done so much for my team, and I don't even do... I'm not even supposed to deal damage. But I am somehow. Your team has You are kidding me. We won that from where? Victory. I do not know how on earth we won that game. That was stupid. We shouldn't have won that game for so long. The fact that that game went as long as it did <laughs> is stupid. It really is. Holy moly. Oh, dear God. God. Um, I think the misfortune I'm probably going to be giving that to because I, she did have a rubbish uh, lane phrase, but, you know, she did manage to pull that back in the end. Like, holy moly. Was that a carry and a half from a tank? And I keep on being told by a lot of people, don't play tanks. You know, that's not how you carry. Sometimes playing a tank is the way to go if you know how to play it. And it's a matter of, like, you know, if it's beneficial to your team. You know, but we just had to wait so long. That that was a 46-minute game, by the way. 46 minutes. We gained 50 LP. Obviously, we're in Iron 2, um, because that's where we started. But hopefully now, the climb starts from here. So we're now 2-on-1. Um, the Talon got system muted quite early on. Um, but you can see the amount of damage that I was doing. I did more damage than the Cassiopeia, and I did more damage than Garen. Even did more damage than the Kaiser. Uh, that was unbelievable how we managed to turn that game around. Like, obviously, you guys can't see Poor Professor, but at one stage, um, about 35 minutes in, I would say, there was 7.6k gold ahead at that stage. At that moment, we started turning it around. Two team fights allowed us to get back in it. And then that last one, obviously, because we got Dragon Soul, really helped out big time. But that was so highly stressful. It was a joke. Oh, dear God. Uh, if you did like the video, don't forget to click the like button. <laughs> if you enjoyed that fiesta, enjoy the carnage. And if you are wanting to see the rest of the climb, see the rest of the placements, then please give a subscribe to the channel. Otherwise, I'm going to leave it there. Enjoy the rest of your day, and I'll see you guys next time.